Hey everybody, it's Ray and uh, Apple just released a new update to iOS 7. As you can see, I have iOS 7 running on my iPhone 5. To do the update, we're going to hit settings. Make sure you're connected to Wi-Fi first. And then we're going to, normally you'll be brought over here. You go to general and you'll hit software update and you'll see what it fixes. It says fixes a fixes bugs that could allow someone to bypass the lock screen passcode, reintroduces a Greek keyboard option for passcode entry. Um, and then you can click over there for more. We're going to hit download and install. As always, you should do a backup before. I'm not going to be responsible for anything that goes wrong. Do backup. This will take less than a minute. For anybody wondering, I am recording right now with an LG G2 Verizon model. Um, you can see that it's focusing in and out. Um, it's fairly decent in low light. Two minutes now. Okay, so we're going to come back when this thing is near done. Okay, so will be right back. So it is now preparing the update. Should be any second now. Gonna pause again and come back when it's near complete. This is taking quite a while. And I've got a pretty fast internet connection, which is... Uh, Pretty darn good, you know? Move my iPhone to a charger because it says it requires 50% battery or more or to be connected to a power source, I have to connect it to a lightning cable. And I'm gonna close. The software is downloaded and it's connecting to a power source. And it should be able to install now, but it looks like it messed up. So, I don't have 50%, but I will do this, and I'll hit install now, and agree, verifying the update, 21 megabyte file, probably like a kajillion people trying to download it at the same time, even though it was released like, I don't know, hours ago. Seems to me like iOS 7 just takes longer to update than iOS 6. If you see my previous videos, you'll see that updates were pretty darn fast. So now it's rebooting. Okay, it rebooted. Now it's going to try to install itself. Boot it again. Now we're getting out a little progress bar. Hopefully, this is not too long. This looks like it's going to crawl, so I'm going to pause it and come back. Okay, so it's just about done. Um, for a bit there, a little bit, last push. There we go. And it's rebooting to the logo screen for the third time.
another loading bar. Wow, I don't even know what to say. I mean, complete. I don't know, man. Another loading bar. How many more of these do we have to go through, Apple? It's kind of ridiculous, don't you think? At least this one's going really fast. Didn't even make it through the end. And now. What happened? Come on. And now it's done. So we're going to slide to unlock. And go off here for a second. Alright. And voila. Anyway, that's how you update your iPhone to iOS 7.0.2. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below. If you see any improvements like battery, performance, any sort of thing like that. Also, leave them in the comments section down below. Um, if you like this video, add to your favorites. Give it a thumbs up. Share it to Facebook and Twitter. And don't forget to subscribe. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.